Now we play a round called English Jokes for English People. This game <laughs> involves Ramesh and Milton, so if you could make your way to the performance area, please. This round is a stand-up challenge. I launched the Wheel of News, and whoever chooses to stop, one of our performers must step forward and talk about that subject. OK, here we go. Let's spin the wheel. The first subject is education. Who wants to go on that? Ramesh. <clears throat> Well, um, as a vegan, um, <laughs> I, I, I had to. I wanted to supplement my son's education, so I'm helping him to to learn to read. That's one of the things that I, I, I'm doing. And, and helping your child to read is is one of the most magical and rewarding things that you can do as a parent um, on day one. <laughs> After that, it's one of the most frustrating, annoying. I'd rather punch myself in the face repeatedly than ever do this again activity that you can ever do. And let me tell you why. They do not care about making sense. <laughs> right? They'll just read all the easy words. When they get to one they don't know, instead of trying, they'll just look at the picture and just throw something random into the sentence without <laughs> any regard for what effect that has <laughs> on what they're saying. And I'm supposed to not get angry. <laughs> I'm supposed to not get angry when my son goes, Jack went strawberry? <laughs> How could that be what it said? How could it be Jack went strawberry? What are you talking about? What would that even look like? How could that be what it said? Tell me. I tell you what, you think that's what it said, you go strawberry now. Go on. <laughs> okay, go strawberry. That's what you think it said. Stop crying, go strawberry. Go, go strawberry. Why don't you do it? Go Kiwi, then. I don't give a shit. <laughs> You're not doing it, are you? I'll tell you why not, because it doesn't make any bloody sense. <laughs> My wife thinks I'm overreacting. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Robert. <laughs>